call the reorganization meeting of the City of Asbury Parks Council to order. Councilmember Chapman. But if you Councilmember Clayton. Councilmember Kendall. Here. Councilmember Quinn. Yes. Mayor Moore. Was that Deputy Mayor Quinn? Well, not yet. Not yet. Oh. Why? She, because she has to be nominated fired. and appointed. Oh, it doesn't carry over? No. Oh, my. Yes. <laughs> Here. Here. <laughs> Next on the uh, agenda is the invocation by Reverend David J. Parriott, Jr. Let us pray. Dear wise and loving God, first let us say thank you on behalf of all who are gathered here today. Thank you for your many and abundant blessings. Thank you for those with the ability to be involved in useful work and for the honor of bearing appropriate responsibility, especially to our God in these stressing extraordinary political itinerary is happening here in 2018 and beyond. In the scriptures, Lord God, it is said that citizens ought to obey the governing authorities. You have established those authorities, Lord, to promote peace and order and justice. Therefore, we pray for our mayor, our deputy mayor, and all council members. We're asking that you would graciously grant them wisdom to govern amid the conflicting interests and issues of our times. We ask that you would grant them a sense of the welfare and true needs of our people. Grant them a keen thirst for impartiality and righteousness. Grant them confidence in what is good and timely. Grant them, Lord God, the ability to work together in harmony even when there is honest disagreement. Grant them personal peace in their lives and joy in their task. We pray for these agendas set before them and all the appointments and resolutions presented here tonight. Please give them an assurance of what would please you and what would benefit those who live and work in and around our beloved city of Asbury Park. It is in your most blessed name that we pray. Amen. Amen. And we thank you. Thank you, Thank you, Reverend Thank you. Thank you. Uh, please rise for the flag salute. Sorry. <laughs> I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. As to comply with the Open Public Meetings Act, Chapter 231, Public Law 1975, adequate notice of this meeting has been provided in the following manner. The reorganization meeting notice was forwarded to the Asbury Park Press, the Coaster, and the Star Ledger on December 14, 2017, and posted on a bulletin board the same day. All notices are on file with the City Clerk. At this time, can I have a nomination for Deputy Mayor, please? I'd like to make a motion that Amy Quinn be to become Deputy Mayor of Asbury Park. I second that. Any other nominations? Hearing none, all in favor? Aye. 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 All opposed? Ayes have it. This time we'll have the swearing in of Deputy Mayor Quinn.
solemnly swear. Do solemnly swear. That I will support the Constitution of the United States. That I will support the Constitution of the United States. And the Constitution of the State of New Jersey. And the Constitution of the State of New Jersey. That I will bear true faith and allegiance. That I will bear true faith and allegiance. To the same. To the same. And to the governments established. To the governments established. In the United States. In the United States. And in this state. And in this state. Under the authority of the people. Under the authority of the people. And I will faithfully. And I will faithfully. Impartially. Impartially. And justly perform. And justly perform. All the duties of. All the duties of. The office of. The office of. City of Asbury Park Deputy Mayor. City of Asbury Park Deputy Mayor. According to the best of my ability. According to the best of my ability. So help me God. So help me God. Congratulations. want to say um, I mean not only am I honored that I get elected to the City Council um, for the last couple of years but um, I also get to serve with really amazing people up here and a great city staff um, Michael included um, and I'm really proud as much as I may drive some of you crazy and scream and yell and um, and be bossy and and whatever but I, I'm really proud to be the deputy mayor of Asbury Park so thank you um, and thank all of you you. We'll continue on to the resolutions. Please bear with me. There's a lot of them tonight. So we're going on for the consent agenda. 2018-1 appointment of deputy mayor. 2018-2 resolution appointing a deputy city clerk for the city of Asbury Park. 2018-3 resolution appointing the registrar of vital statistics. Resolution 2018-4, resolution establishing meeting dates for 2018, 2018-5, resolution designating official newspaper for the city of Asbury Park for the year of 2018. Uh, 2018-6, resolution providing for the 2018 temporary budget. 2018-7, resolution adopting cash management plan for the city of Asbury Park. 2018-8, resolution of the mayor and council of the city of Asbury Park designating depositories wherein the public monies and other funds of the municipality shall be kept. 2018-9, resolution adopting debt management plan and capital policy. 2018-10, resolution of the mayor and council of the city of Asbury Park fixing the rate of interest to be charged on delinquent tax assessments and sewer accounts for 2018. 2018-11, resolution to credit sewer account for deduct meter. Resolution 2018-12, resolution to cancel taxes on city-owned properties. 2018-13, resolution providing for fees for tax sales certificate redemption calculations. Resolution 2018-14, resolution establishing a service charge for return checks at, or written instruments. 2018-15, resolution authorizing issuance of certificate of redemption of, for, of tax sale certificates due to inability to locate the original tax sale certificates. 2018-16, resolution authorizing premium to a sheet to municipalities after five years. 2018-17, appointment of ADA compliance officer and coordinator. 2018-18, appointment of fund commissioner and alternate fund commissioner of the New Jersey Intergovernment Insurance Fund. 2018-19, designation of public agency compliance officer. 2018-20, appointment recycling coordinator. 2018-21, resolution authorizing tax assessor to act as an agent for the city of Asbury Park for the purpose of filing and settling tax appeals on behalf of the taxing district of the tax year 2018. 2018-22, authorizing the city clerk to execute the City of Asbury Park Fire Department member enrollment into the New Jersey State Firemen's Association for the 2018 calendar year. And finally, 2018-23, authorizing the city clerk to execute all bingo and raffle games 
of chance application that meet all provisions pursuant to the statute for the 2018 calendar year. Does any of the members of council wish to remove any of those resolutions off the agenda, of the consent agenda? Hearing none, can I have a motion to approve, please? Move it. Second. Councilmember Chapman? Yes. Councilmember Kendall? Yes. Deputy Mayor Quinn? Yes. Mayor Moore? Yes. Before you go on to the next, yes. let me just, uh, I should have done it sooner. Uh, Councilwoman Clayton is not here tonight because with this type of weather, she had a pipe burst. She doesn't know where, if it's in her yard, if it's in her neighbor's yard, but her cellar is flooded out. So she's dealing with that. And I would like to recognize and thank Freeholder Curley for being in tennis tonight. I deeply appreciate it and thank you, sir. Okay. okay. We'll continue on to individual resolutions. Resolution 2018-24 appointing Frederick C. Refredo, Esquire, to serve as municipal attorney for the city and authorizing execution of agreement for professional legal services associated therewith. Can I have a motion, please? Move it. Second. Any comments or questions? Councilmember Chapman? Yes. Councilmember Kendall? Yes. Deputy Mayor Quinn? Yes. Mayor Moore? Yes. Resolution 2018-25, authorizing the execution of agreement with engineering services with T&M Associates. Can I have a motion, please? Move it. Second. Comments or questions? Councilmember Chapman? Yes. Councilmember Kendall? Yes. Deputy Mayor Quinn? Yes. Mayor Moore? Yes. Resolution 2018-26, appointing Cleary? Oh. Jacoby. <laughs> Jacoby <laughs> Alfieri <laughs> Jacobs, thanks. LLC to serve as conflict municipal attorney for the city and authorizing the execution of agreement for professional legal services associated therewith. Can I have a motion, please? Move it. Second. Second. Any comments or questions? Councilmember Chapman? Yes. Councilmember Kendall? Yes. Deputy Mayor Quinn? Yes. Mayor Moore? Yes. Resolution 2018-27, appointing Archer and Griner PC to serve as bond counsels for the city and authorizing the execution of agreement for professional legal services associated therewith. Can I have a motion, please? Move it. Second. Comments or questions? Council Member Chapman? Yes. Council Member Kendall? Yes. Deputy Mayor Quinn? Yes. Mayor Moore? Yes. Resolution 2018-28, appointing Law Offices of Stephen S. Glickman, LLC, to serve as Labor Counsel for the City and authorizing execution of the agreement for professional legal services associated therewith. Can I have a motion, please? Move it. Second. Comments or questions? Councilmember Chapman? Yes. Councilmember Kendall? Yes. Deputy Mayor Quinn? Yes. Mayor Moore? Yes. Resolution 2018-29, I believe we are tabling this evening. Can I have a motion to table? Move it. Second. Second. Councilmember Chapman? Yes. Councilmember Kendall? Yes. Deputy Mayor Quinn? Yes. Mayor Moore? Yes. Resolution 2018-30, appointing Redevelopment <laughs> Council, Mar Marazidi, Falcon, and authorizing the execution of agreement of professional services associated with therewith. Can I have a motion, please? Move it. Second. Comments or questions? Councilmember Chapman? Yes. Councilmember Kendall? Yes. Deputy Mayor Quinn? Yes. Mayor Moore? Yes. <laughs> Resolution 2018-31, appointing GGEM Insurance Agency to serve as an insurance broker, consultant, risk manager, and authorizing the execution of agreement for professional services associated therewith. Can I have a motion, please? Move, Move it. Second. Comments or questions? Council Member Chapman? Yes. Council Member Kendall? Yes. Deputy Mayor Quinn? Yes. Mayor Moore? Yes. Resolution 2018-32, appointing Harry Hall Sauter, Esquire, to serve as Special Tax Counsel for the City and authorizing the execution of an agreement for professional legal services associated therewith. Can I have a motion, please? Move it. Second. Comments or questions? Council Member Chapman? Yes. Council Member Kendall? Yes. Deputy Mayor Quinn? Yes. Mayor Moore? Yes. Resolution 2018-33, appointing Arcacia Financial Group, Inc., to serve as the financial advisors for the city and authorizing the execution of agreement for professional services associated therewith. Can I have a motion, please? Move it. Second. Comments or questions? Council Member Chapman? Yes. Council Member Kendall? Yes. Deputy Mayor Quinn? Yes. Mayor Moore? Yes. Resolution 2018-34, authorizing the execution of agreement for professional appraisal services of BRB Valuations, Pamela J. Brodowski, M-A-I-A-S-A-C-T-A. -A -A Can I have a motion, please? Move. Second. Second. Comments or questions? Councilmember Chapman? Yes. Councilmember Kendall? Yes. Deputy Mayor Quinn? Yes. Mayor Moore? Yes. 
Resolution awarding professional services for grant writing services. Can I have a motion, please? Move it. Second. Comments or questions? Councilmember Chapman? Yes. Councilmember Kendall? Yes. Deputy Mayor Quinn? Yes. Mayor Moore? Yes. Resolution 2018-36, appointing members to the planning board, class three and class four. The following members are presented to be appointed this evening. Council member Yvonne Clayton as a class three member with a term expiring 12-31-2018. Move it. Oh, I'm not done, hold on. <laughs> Barbara Krasak, class four, term expiring 12-31-2021. And Jim Henry, alternate one, term expiring 12-31-18. And Allison McLeod, alternate two, unexpired term of 12-31-19. Now can I have a motion, please? Move it. Second. Any comments or questions? Council Member Chapman? Yes. Council Member Kendall? Yes. Deputy Mayor Quinn? Yes. Mayor Moore? Yes. Resolution 2018-37, appointing members to the Zoning Board of Adjustments. The following are being appointed uh, or presented to be appointed by the uh, Council for Zoning Board of Adjustment. Michelle McGuire, regular member, term expiring 12-31-21. Daniel Harris, regular member, term expiring 12-31-21. And, and Jennifer Souter, alternate number two, term expiring 12-31-19. Can I have a motion, please? Move, Move it. Second. Second. Any comments or questions? Council Member Chapman? Yes. Council Member Kendall? Yes. Deputy Mayor Quinn? Yes. Mayor Moore? Yes. Resolution 2018-38, authorizing appointment to the Environmental Shade Tree Commission. The following members are presented to be appointed this evening. Jim Henry, with a term, ex all the terms are expiring December 31st, 2022. Jim Henry, Tom Calusa, Garrett Guyverson, and Gerald Liss. Can I have a motion, please? Move it. Second. Any comments or questions? <clears throat> Council Member Chapman? Yes. Council Member Kendall? Yes. Deputy Mayor Quinn? Yes. Mayor Moore? Yes. Resolution 2018-39, resolution authorizing appointments to the Sunset Lake Commission. The following members are being uh, presented to be appointed. Council Member Chapman with a term expiring 12-31-18. William McClave, 12-31-18. Sue Henderson, 12-31-19. Patrick Reeling, 12-31-19. Mark Axe, 12-31-19. Jamie Nadell, 12-31-19. Christopher Avalone, 12-31-18, Garrett Garberson, 12-31-18, and Chester Bowles, alternate two, 12-31-19, and Garrett Garberson was alternate one. Can I have a motion, please? Move it. Second. Second. Comments or questions? Council Member Chapman? Yes. Council Member Kendall? Yes. Deputy Mayor Quinn? Yes. Mayor Moore? Yes. Resolution 2018-40, authorizing appointments to the Deal Lake Commission. The following members are being presented to be appointed. Jeannie Toller, regular member 12-31-18, and Andrew L. Chamber, 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 alternate one member 12-31-18. Can I have a motion, please? Move it. Second. Comments or questions? Council Member Chapman? Yes. Council Member Kendall? Yes. Deputy Mayor Quinn? Yes. Mayor Moore? Yes. Resolution 2018-41, authorizing appointments to the Public Arts Commission. The following members are being presented to be appointed. Deputy Mayor Qu Quinn for 12-31-18. Michelle Alonzo, 12-31-18. Marilyn Schlossbach, alternate two for term 12-31-18. Jen Hampton, 12-31-20. Ellen, Ga Ellen Gaynor, alternate one, 12-31-19. Andrew Poland, 12-31-19. Patrick Schiavano, 12-31-20. Malcolm Navius, 12-31-19, and Michael Sedano, 12-31-20. Have a motion, please. Move it. Second. Comments or questions? Council Member Chapman? Yes. Council Member Kendall? Yes. Deputy Mayor Quinn? Yes. Mayor Moore? Yes. Resolution 2018-42, authorizing appointments to the Asbury Park TV Committee, also known as APTV. The following members are being presented to be appointed. Deputy Mayor Quinn, term expiring 1231 18. Drew Chimback, with an unexpired term of 1231 18. Jessica Lima, with an unexpired term of 1231 19. Ed Salvez, with a term expiring 1231 20. Adam Nelson, 1231 20. And Nate McAllister, 1231 20. Can I have a motion, please? Move it. Second. Okay. Comments or questions? Councilmember Chapman? Yes. Councilmember Kendall? Yes. Deputy Mayor Quinn? Yes. Mayor Moore? Yes. Resolution 2018-43, appointment of the Recreation Advisory Committee. The following members are being presented to be appointed. 
Council Member Jesse Kendall, 1231-18. Council Member Eileen Chapman, 1231-18. And the rest are all 1231-18. Leisha Foyd, Esther Kierkarski, Torin Jordan, Angeline, Angeline Brown, Nancy Sabino, Angela Anderson, Douglas Eagles, and Jesse Ricks. Can I have a motion, please? Move it. Second. Comments or questions? Councilmember Chapman? Yes. Councilmember Kendall? Yes. Deputy Mayor Quinn? Yes. Mayor Moore? Yes. Resolution 2018-44, establishing a parking advisory committee in and for the City of Asbury Park. The following members are being presented to be appointed. All terms expiring 12-31-2018. Mayor Moore, Michael Manzella, Jean Dello, Barbara Krasak, Maggie Quinton, William West, Brett Morgan, Amber Kuna, and Jordan Modell. Can I have a motion, please? Move it. Second. Second. Comments or questions? Councilmember Chapman? Yes. Councilmember Kendall? Yes. Deputy Mayor Quinn? Yes. Mayor Moore? Yes. Resolution 2018-45, establishing a code enforcement quality of life committee in and of the City of Asbury Park and authorizing appointments thereto. The following members are being presented to be appointed. All terms expiring 12-31-2018. Councilmember Yvonne Clayton, Councilmember Eileen Chapman, Rob McEwen, Ellie Kamichin, Hannah Walker, Norman Wa Robertson, Trudy Syfax, Rita Williams, Karen Kircher, Greg Hobson, Bonnie Barrett, and Melanie Chongolia Chung Nestor. Can I have a motion, please? Move it. Second. Any comments or questions? Councilmember Chapman? Yes. Councilmember Kendall? Yes. Deputy Mayor Quinn? Yes. Mayor Moore? Yes. Resolution 2018-46, appointment to the Business Advisory Committee. The following members are being presented to be appointed. All terms expire 12-31-2018. Deputy Mayor Quinn, Michael Capabianco, Jen Hampton, Bianca Frida, Kathy Kelly, Leslie Castellini, Marilyn Schlossbach, Russell Lewis, Reggie Flomlin, Jackie Sharp, Larry Dumbrum, Phyllis Butia Mafusa, Isaac Jones, Adam Nelson, and Sylvia Sylvia Coffee. Can I have a motion, please? Move it. Second. Comments or questions? Councilmember Chapman? Yes. Councilmember Kendall? Yes. Deputy Mayor Quinn? Yes. Mayor Moore? Yes. Resolution 2018-47, resolution mm -hmm. establishing a budget committee in and of the city of Asbury Park. The following members are being presented to be appointed, all terms expiring 12-31-2018. The city manager or his designee, Mayor Moore, Council Member Eileen Chapman, Barbara Krasak, Robert Leitner, and Donna Vieira. Can I have a motion, please? Move it. Second. <coughs> Comments or questions? Council Member Chapman? Yes. Council Member Kendall? Yes. Deputy Mayor Quinn? Yes. Mayor Moore? Yes. Resolution 2018-48, establishing a community development block grant committee in and for the city of Asbury Park and authorizing appointments thereto. The following members are being presented to be appointed, all with terms expiring 12-31-18. Mayor Moore, Deputy Mayor Quinn, Cassandra Dickerson, Leisha Floyd, Janice Malloy, Susan Mayer, and Patrick Qu uh, Jaquinto. Can I have a motion, please? Move it. Second. Comments or questions? Councilmember Chapman? Yes. Councilmember Kendall? Councilmember Kendall? Hold on one second. No, no, we're on the CDPG. Yep, yeah. Next one. Go ahead. Councilmember Kendall? Yes. Deputy Mayor Quinn? Yes. Mayor Moore? Yes. Resolution 2018-49. Resolution established in Mayor's Wellness Committee in and of the City of Asbury Park. Okay. All right, the following members are being presented to be appointed. All terms expiring 12-31-2018. Uh, Mayor Moore. Jesse Kendall, Council Member Ken Jesse Kendall, Michael Manzella, Lisa Lee, Wendy Glassman, Allison Serco, Vishal Saad, Lena Sidiqui, and Douglas Eagles. Can I have a motion, please? Move, Move it. it. Second. Comments or questions? 
Councilmember Chapman? Yes. Councilmember Kendall? Yes. Deputy Mayor Quinn? Yes. Mayor Moore? Yes. We'll move on to announcements uh, for the mayor's appointments to the planning board. For class one, the mayor wishes to appoint himself as the class one member of the planning board. And as the class two member, he would like to appoint Michael Manzella, who's the city transportation planner, to the planning board. We'll now move on to the announcement by the uh, for the mayor's appointment for the position of the Office of Office of Emergency Management OEM Director. Mayor Moore wishes to appoint Garrett Garberson as the OEM Director for the City of Asbury Park. Now move on to comments from council members. I have nothing. Okay. Well, Happy New Year to everyone. Glad to see everyone. Um, the Recreations Committee, December the 16th, uh, gave a meet and greet because we were so thankful for the support that we have gotten from the, the community. And I want to give a special thank you to Michael, um, our city manager, for us uh, really digging down low and helping us out financially as best he could. And um, Eileen Chapman, she's also on, she's the co-chairman of the committee, and um, we was looking for a place, and VFW stepped up, and they were so, they said she is so passionate, I say in a professional way, and they said they just couldn't turn her down, so we, we saved some money there, and we had uh, over 200 people show up. We had to close down early because people were just coming in, and I think all the people that supported us we gave out numerous awards, and this year we gave out, I, how did it go, Asbury Park Recreation First Annual Man of the Year, and I came to Mayor Moore. It was about four or five other people, participants, and I had everybody voted for Mayor Moore, so another congratulations. And I want to thank um, the council, because they stood behind us, and and um, we really appreciate it. So I hope this coming year be as good as we had last year and I thank you all stay blessed uh, happy new year that's all <laughs> comments from <laughs> mayor Moore <laughs> yeah uh, very few at this point first of all I, I love and like to thank uh, Reverend Parriott and when you invite Reverend Parriott you get his better half <laughs> Mrs. Parriott and uh, We've known each other for so many years, and for you to come out tonight in this weather and do what you did is deeply appreciated. Everybody else in the audience tonight, I deeply appreciate you coming out again tonight in this weather. Uh, again, Freeholder Curly, deeply appreciate it. Uh, and can't thank you enough. And 2018 is going, we're going to rock it. Can I have a, an, another chance? To <laughs> I'd just uh, like to remind there. everyone about the coat drive. Um, we're still collecting coats uh, at the city manager's office that will be distributed on January 13th. So if you've got uh, coats, hats, gloves, anything that could be used uh, by folks in need, please drop it off. And I overlook someone, excuse me, Pam, thank you for you and your husband for helping us out. We really appreciate it. You was a big help and always is. Thank you. Okay. Okay. All right, at this time, can I have a motion to open the meeting to the public, please? Move it. Second. Second. Anybody wishing to speak, please state your name and address for the record, and each member of the public has three minutes to speak. Please come up to the mic in the rear. Motion to close. Move it. Second. Wait, wait, a minute. Uh, well, well, wait a second. <laughs> <laughs> I think you tricked us. I caught you just in time. <coughs> Mayor, members of the council, good evening. John Curley, Mummet County Freeholder, Middletown, New Jersey. Uh, it's a privilege to be here this evening. Uh, this is a great city. And it's a great city because of the citizens of, uh, of Asbury Park, and certainly the governing bodies over the years. And uh, I know that each and every one of you put forth a phenomenal effort in uh, trying to make sure that the services of the community are met. And that's not an easy job. I served on the borough council in Red Bank uh, at one point in my political career. But I want to wish everyone a happy new year. Uh, I oversee the Human Service Social Service Division. If I can be of any assistance to any member of the Asbury Park public, please feel free to call upon me. Uh, I am there. I'm a full-time freeholder. 
and uh, certainly I, for the most part, return my own phone calls. So I thank you so much for uh, indulging me this evening. And uh, Mayor Moore, on a personal note, uh, thank you for your graciousness, as always, in your phone call to me uh, a number of weeks ago. Greatly appreciate it. God bless everybody. Thank you. Thank you. Uh, thank, thank you, and uh, we wish you and your family, again, a happy new year. And as much as you're on that commission, when we've had problems in the past, be it with Sunset Lake and everything, uh, Freehold and Curly was the first one down there with everybody else to look at our problems in the past. So you are deeply appreciated in Asbury Park. John, I also sanctioned, I had the Board of Health up until Friday, and that's been moved to another freeholder. But uh, I also sanctioned a study uh, to look at the bacteria levels in the Deal Lake. Fantastic. Yeah, thank you so much. Thank you again. Thank you. Motion to close? Move no. On. Public portion. Closed public room. Yes. 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 <laughs> We're still on public. <laughs> I, I thought you said adjourn. No, to close. <laughs> Move. <laughs> Have a second. Second. Okay. Mayor Moore. <laughs> yes. <laughs> okay. Uh, that was a very nice meeting. Again, thank you for everybody attending. Now let's get to like snow. Uh, we're, we're definitely going to be hit with snow. The predictions are up and down. It depends how far the storm. Right now, Savannah, everybody's getting hit. Comes close to the coast. Uh, we're, we're looking between 6 and 20 inches. Uh, we also have a coastal flood advisory out uh, through tomorrow at 3 p.m. Tomorrow's high tide is around 9 a.m. So anybody with uh, cars in low-lying areas should definitely move them. It's going to be very cold, very windy, uh, with a small break coming Sunday and warm weather on Monday. Now, the problem, unfortunately, with warm weather is after a deep freeze like we've had the past week or so, is underground pipes start to break. So we're going to have probably some water main breakage, which will keep you informed as far as Nixle. Uh, next door and everything else and that's again why Councilwoman Clayton is not here tonight because she already had a pipe break uh, Again, it is going to snow. We don't know how much Nobody does but be prepared. We have a phone call into the superintendent of schools Whatever he decides to do we will back hundred percent if he wants to cancel if he wants to when he makes his decision again, we will share that on Nixel and next door and Michael, one great thing we did this past year, of many, is we got a full generator into City Hall. So if we ever have a tragedy, be it Sandy, a terrible snowstorm like uh, 88 or anything else, 92, we have full power in entire City Hall. So we're up and ready for that. Uh, DPW is mounted everything, salt trucks ready. We pre-treated all the roads. Uh, we're as prepared as prepared can be, but again, not knowing if it's going to be 6 or 20, it's a heck of a guess. But uh, any complaints, uh, any concerns, uh, telephone lines will be open tomorrow and public reach out. But we ask people, please, unless it's an emergency, stay off the road. Please do not double park and shut down the roads where fire, police, or first aid cannot get to somebody in real trouble. Please go by the rules and regulations as far as alternate side parking and everything, and we'll make it through this storm with no problem. And uh, I appreciate it, and I thank you, and again, Happy New Year to everybody. And in 2018, I really believe we are going to rock it. Can you explain alternate side? Too long. <laughs> if follow, follow Nick's will follow next door. Okay. All right. Because <laughs> we don't know when it's going to snow, and it all depends on that. Okay. Anything else? A motion to adjourn? Move it. Second. Okay. Yeah.